Hey, today I volunteered with uh, my buddy Rob. He has a business where he builds tiny houses for people, and in exchange, he agreed to come on camera and answer a few questions. Isn't that right? Yep, absolutely. Great, Rob. So you build tiny houses for people. Out of all the people who were searching on the internet today, who are you most interested in getting in front of with your website? <clears throat> Um, you know, progressive-minded people, you know, people who want to, you know, downsize their life, uh, make life a little simpler, um, make things a little easier by, uh, you know, getting rid of all the superfluous stuff in their life and, uh, you know, living, uh, living in a, you know, a smaller world, I think, but uh, opening, you know, people are also interested in kind of a community vibe, too. Definitely. That's the whole tiny house movement. But what I really wanted was the answer was less philosophical. Out of all the people who are searching for things on the internet, what are the people that are searching for you typing into the search engine? Um, tiny house builders, tiny house uh, designers. Um, Build my tiny house? Yeah, sure. Okay, sure. cool. So um, I just want to ask you this question. If there was a digital product out there, that allowed you to get in front of everyone, let's say, in the state of Colorado mm -hmm. who had searched for Build My Tiny House, um, how much would you be willing to pay to get in front of those people? Um, that's, a, that's a good question. Um, it depends on, I guess, the, the services that are involved with what I would be paying for. Okay. Um, well, let's say like the a, like a, mo a monthly fee kind of scenario or, no, or mean, like just like a... a, a you sell these for about 50 grand or more. Sure. Um, how much would you think you'd be willing to spend to get right in front of that somebody who said, build my tiny house? Um, I don't know, maybe five or 600 bucks. Okay, cool. Yeah, because you know, if you get in front of enough of those people, you're gonna sell one. Sure, sure. Right, okay, well what if there was a product that, um, allowed you to get in front of everybody in the state of Colorado who had ever typed in build my tiny house and um, and they had the option to skip your video and and then if they actually watched your video then you'd pay not five hundred dollars but just two to twelve cents sure does that sound like something you'd want to do yeah absolutely yeah because then you'd be able to show them exactly what your business does how it does it sure and how you could do it for them and um, they've got the option to skip that video ad, sure. but if they actually end up watching it for 30 seconds or more, it means they're interested in whatever it is you're saying. Sure. So you're going to get a really good targeted approach to your digital advertising spend right. on the internet. That's what a YouTube video ad, ad is, and I'm teaching people how to do this in a free class. And so I just wanted to highlight the opportunity that lies within these YouTube video ads. It's the best way to spend your digital advertising dollars today because of how targeted it is and how inexpensive it is right now. But it won't be that forever because the competition is low, which means it's not saturated yet. Not very many people are making right, right, right. these YouTube video ads. Yeah. So the price will eventually go up, but right now it's really low. You can get hundreds of great targeted impressions and views and click-throughs to your website, which are free in this mm -hmm. style of digital advertising. So I just wanted to invite you and anybody watching this video to my free seminar on July 2nd at BHS, 7 a.m. Thursday morning. Don't miss it.